15 Best Balinese Food Local foods you must try when visiting Bali Thousands of islands with different cultures make up Indonesia, so it's no wonder that Balinese food is just as diverse. To complement your holiday experience in Bali, you would not want to miss out on some of its most popular dishes. Number 1. Shathe Lilit. Bali's variant is the Shathe Lilit. Made from either minced beef, chicken, fish, pork, or even turtle meat, it's mixed with coconut, coconut milk, and a rich blend of spices. The shathe is then wrapped around bamboo, sugarcane or lemongrass sticks before it's grilled over charcoal. You can enjoy shathe lilit with or without dipping sauce. Number 2. Nasi Champha. Nasi Champha are served at many warrings or small eateries and restaurants throughout the island. A plate of white rice comes with different elements of Balinese food, such as a portion of babi guling, betutu, mixed vegetables, and a dab of spicy sambal matter. Nasi chamfer are sometimes served with a bowl of soup. For those who do not want it too spicy, simply ask for it without the sambal. Number 3. Bebek and I am betutu. Betutu is the slow cooked of duck or chicken. This iconic Balinese dish consists of a whole chicken or ayam or duck or bevik stuffed with traditional spices, wrapped in banana leaves, then enveloped tight in the bark of a banana trunk. The entire thing is baked or buried in a coal fire for 6 to 7 hours, resulting in a rich and juicy meat that easily separates from the bones. Number 4. Barbie Guling. Barbie guling is an all-time favorite, consisting of spit-roast pig stuffed with rich traditional spices and vegetable mixes such as cassava leaves, slowly rolled over a coal fire. Guling means, to roll, in Indonesian. The crisp brown skins are prized, while the meat is a tender and juicy treat. At first, babi guling was a communal treat during special festivities and ceremonies, but you can find it at many warrings or food stalls and restaurants that specialize in this dish. Number 5. Tum. Tourists and cuisine enthusiasts can find the delicious tum wrapped neatly with banana leaves. The food consists of minced chicken or beef, put together with mashed spices and herbs like garlic, shallots, chilies, bay leaves, gingers, lemongrass, and more. Everything is put together compactly, making it convenient to eat as a main course or snack on the go. Number 6. Sambal Mata. This tasty Balinese hot sauce or sambal has made its way to restaurants and households from all over Indonesia. Each culture has their own creation of a chili-based condiment but sambal mata is loved for its fresh sensation. Shallots, garlic, and chilies, which are common ingredients for Indonesian hot sauces, are chopped or blended, giving it a delightful texture. The secret for the fresh sensation is the touch of lime leaves and lemongrass. Sambal mata can enhance the flavor of a simple fried chicken, pork, or egg dish. Number 7. Lawa. Lawa is a mix of finely chopped meat, vegetables, grated coconut and spices. In some areas of Bali, this traditional dish is prepared by mixing fresh animal blood with meat and spices to strengthen the flavor. The dish is usually served immediately after preparation as it cannot be kept long. There are two main types of lawa, white and red. The white version appeals to vegans and vegetarians as it doesn't contain meat or blood. Number 8. Mojaya Nyat Nyat. Mojaya is the name of a fish, which won't taste good if processed without the expertise and special seasonings. Well, Bali has its own solution for processing freshwater fish like Mojaya. Due to its special processing, the food is called nyat nyat, which derived from the word, receding, or, shrinking. The word is a symbol of the soil taste that is shrinking to decrease due to the processing. In addition, the method of processing is also cooked until the spices shrink and are fully absorbed into the meat. Number 9. Nasi Jingo. Although it comes in small portions, nasi jingo is a big part of the locals' daily life. They say you can fit a portion of nasi jingo in the palm of your hand, and it seems just about right. 
consisting of rice, vegetables, and a side dish and condiment wrapped together inside a banana leaf, Nasi Jingo is an affordable food alternative for locals and tourists alike. Usually, the side dish options are shredded chicken, egg, or noodles. Tourists can find Nasi Jingo sold on motorcycles parked on the side of Bali's main streets. Number 10. Rajak Kwa Pindang. You can find a lot of fruit salad in Bali, combined with abundant brown sugar sauce. But, Rajak Kwa Pindang is different. It offers you a special taste. This fruit salad uses Pindang gravy as its main ingredient. Pindang gravy comes from the water of boiled Pindang fish could be from tuna, lemuru, or sardines. This fruit salad contains mostly tropical fruits such as cucumber, pineapple, young papaya, rasped, young mango, yam bean, guava, apple, and salic. The combination of all these ingredients will create a savory, fresh, spicy and sour taste simultaneously. It will burst in your mouth and is ready to make you addicted. Enjoy every bite of it. Rajak Kwa Pindang is suitable to be consumed during the day. Number 11. Thapat Shantik. Thapat Shantik is a common traditional Balinese food that can be found almost anywhere in Bali. It's made of mixed steamed vegetables, water lily, long beans and bean sprout with rice cake mixed with peanut sauce. Sometimes, the pat shantik is added with sweet soy sauce on the top to add sweet taste on it. The pat shantik can be found on local small Balinese warrings but rarely be found on big restaurants. Number 12. Plessing Kangkung. Plessing Kangkung is made of steam water lily with chili and tomato sauce. Plessing Kangkung is normally served cold, not right away after it's cooked. It is normally spicy and consider as a snack. Number 13. Sirombotan. Sirombotan is a traditional Balinese food from Klungkung. It made of mixed boiled vegetables, water lily, spinach, bean sprout, raw rounded eggplant, long beans, red bean and pear, fried peanuts and fried soybean. It is added with grated coconut mixed with spices and chili sauce with lime juice. Number 14. Rajak Bulung. Rajak Bulung seaweed is one of the top favorite dishes among the people of Bali. Finding Rajak Bulung won't be too demanding as it can be easily found in plenty of stalls that sell local Balinese cuisine. Aside from having Rajak Bulung for its mouth-watering tang, the Balinese generally eat this dish when they're experiencing nausea attributable to its ability to get rid of sickness and vomiting. Number 15. Traditional desserts. Traditional desert in Bali are collectively called Jajan and Pasa traditional market cakes. Originally used to accompany ceremonial offerings, these local desserts are now available throughout the day. There are plenty of Jajan and Pasa to choose from, which mainly use rice flour, glutinous rice, palm sugar, and coconut. Some of the most common desserts in Bali include jajay batan bedal glutinous rice balls in palm sugar soup, bubu injun, black glutinous rice porridge, pisang rai, steamed banana, and kelapon coconut covered rice cake with liquid palm sugar. Thank you for watching, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn the notification bell on. See you on the other video.